Hey guys, Alex Sutherland here. You may know me as the creator of GTO Range Builder or as a sub from Car Runners. And today I am making my second video about Simple GTO Trainer. This is a program I made in conjunction with the Simple PostFlop team that lets you practice playing against computed GTO solutions. So if you didn't catch part one, I showed briefly how you can load up the free included pre-computed solutions. This program is in beta, so everything is free currently. And you can pick one of the situations that we've already computed GTO play for you in, like this one is 100 big blind cutoff versus uh, big blind single race pot. You can click play and you can practice playing against a GTO opponent. Here I'm out of position uh, and you can play out the flop turn and river and get real time feedback on how your play compares to GTO. So here, for example, uh, GTO play almost always checks. It very rarely bets and it says I lost a little EV by betting this turn. I also showed that there are drills where you can practice a specific uh, skill over and over like c-betting. So if you want to check all that information out, it shows how to install the program, how to set it up, all the basics. Go check out that previous video. In this video, I'm going to be focused on one of the more advanced features, which is how to create your own custom situations based on your own solutions. And there is a few ways to do this. If you own the simple post flop standalone post flop solver, you can compute any solutions you like and load them in by putting them in a folder, clicking add and selecting, I'll go through the process in a minute. The alternative option is if you own PO solvers, support for PO solver solutions will be coming soon. And then finally, if you have the free version of simple post flop, but you've purchased some pre flop packs, those all come with all the post flop component solutions available for you to download and use. And so I'm going to give an example of getting solutions from there. But whether you get your solutions from Simple PostFlop, from PO Solver, whatever, the process will all be the same. You need to put them in some folder and then load that folder into GTO Trainer. So let's take a look at how that works. I'm going to start by setting up a drill. I'm going to practice uh, c-betting as under the gun versus big blind in a cash game. So I would select drill game. This means I'll just practice the same action repeatedly rather than playing out a whole post flop hand. And this is something that you can do without a uh, simple post flop standalone installed. So I'm gonna give this a name, give it a under gun versus BBC betting. And then I need to choose a solution directory that contains the GTO solutions. And so what you can do is you can Choose where you've downloaded the solutions. If you have simple post flop, you can, if you've purchased a pre flop pack, you can go here, click this download flops button, and then save it to whatever folder you want, unzip it, and that is the solution folder you need to go to. So then you navigate to the part of the game tree in the solution folder that you want to deal with. I want to look at single raise pots after a 3x. Uh, simple post flop internally stores half the small blind as part of the pot, so instead of calling a 3x, it looks like it's calling a 3.25x, but don't worry about that. I click select folder and I am good to go. Click next. And then for my drill, I need to select which part of the solution I want to practice it on. So I'm going to be practicing how I react after out of position checks. So I select the node I want to react to. Click save and I am good to go. Now I can click this and play it. And as you can see here, I'm in position. We both have 97 chips left after my 3x open. I'm under the gun with uh, this under the gun opening range is the assumed range. And my opponent is flatting a pretty tight range here. So I can go ahead and uh, say that I would always bet my eights. It'll tell me that GTO actually checks its eights and bets its eights sometimes. And I can go from there. Now the alternative is if I want to make a custom game. And for this, you will need your simple post flop standalone license because the software does real time GTO calculations as you play so that you can simulate playing against a GTO bot, kind of similar to what the uh, brains versus AI challenge did where they had the uh, bot that beat the human players was dynamically solving turns and rivers on the fly. Simple post flop is doing a similar thing behind the scenes here. So to set that up, there's one extra step. You need to go to your settings here and you need to put the folder where you have your simple post flop .exe file installed. In general, it's going to be app data roaming simple post flop. You can choose how fast you want it to be. It's almost instant on a fast PC if you put it on normal and you have good accuracy. If you want really accurate solutions, you can uh, up the accuracy. 
Generally, that's only going to be necessary if you're dealing with a lot of bet size options. Once you have this all set, you go back to custom games, do the same kind of thing, but select regular training. And I'm going to say this is under the gun oops, versus BB, six max cash. Again, navigate to the download folder here. And this time I don't need to select an action to respond to because I'm playing out the whole post flop situation. And then I can click play and boom, I'm in, I'm in position. I can uh, play out this hand here and everything works. So that is how to set up your own situations. And obviously this is super powerful because it means if you have access to post flop solution files, you can use your own calculations to deal with any custom spots that you want to deal with and practice them with all the same kind of powerful reporting and data analysis that you get from uh, GTO Trainer, which I demoed in the previous video. So I will leave this video here. If you guys have any questions, please post in the comments. I will include a download link to the software in the description below as well. So check that out. Thanks for watching.